Hey guys, Silence Yao here. Welcome back to another Utah Macross Gacha video. Before we begin, let me just let inform you there is a brand new video for Pokemon Cafe Remix and it might be the last one for my channel depending on how um, I might do this series of game um, in the future because it seems like the playstyle has changed up quite a bit that really doesn't uh, justify a stage to stage tutorial on how to clear the game um, because now they've given us players a bit more freedom in terms of choices of who we choose to serve uh, that kind of stuff so go watch that video and help me decide um, <clears throat> you know um, if I should do future um, content for Pokemon Cafe Remix as a stream or if you like to see them as uh, still casual video uploads on my channel once in a while. Um, even if you're not a big fan of the game, you know, it will help me out greatly if you just help me check out and then decide as well. Uh, it would do me a very big favour. Um, and apologise if you heard that dragging sound earlier. It seems my neighbour is still not done with <laughs> reconstructing their home. It's been over three weeks now. Oh my goodness, what in the world are they building up there? Not uh, not the evil lair, I hope. <laughs> Anyways, um, let's get down to everything Uta Macross now. So if you guys have been playing the current uh, Macross 7 event that's going on, of course, the main song is Hello, which I've already explained in the um, November update video. Hopefully you guys have checked that out, especially if you want to keep up to date with whatever costumes are being featured for the, the month of November, the event songs and all that kind of stuff. So I've heard some of you guys um, commenting on that video, which is pretty awesome, um, especially for those who are Macross Plus fans and Macross 7 fans. Uh, there's a lot of love going on for you this month, uh, which is good for me as well because my wallet is safe. <laughs> so yes, all the Uta Macross Gacha videos this month for me, um, I won't be spending any of my physical cash to purchase Singing Storm packs because luckily enough, the featured 7 star plates aren't my waifus so for those of you who are Basara stands and Kaname stands uh, this month is a bit painful for you guys um, for me at least there is a Ranka costume at the end of the month but you know it's um, a costume that isn't exactly that essential for me to unlock um, it can be still gotten through maybe getting the basic points for the costume and then unlocking it through episode ops in the future I hope you guys understand what I'm talking without um, you know, some visual aids and all that kind of stuff because we've been doing this for 4 years now and for those of you who are new, please go ahead, go ahead, uh, watch through some of my past videos. Yeah, it will help the channel as well as uh, you know, helping you guys understand um, you know, how to con, you know, con, uh, how we navigate, yes that's the proper term, navigate through the game. So before we dive into the gacha, I'm gonna talk a bit about you know how difficult <laughs> the event's extreme version of the song is. I mean, it, it's not exactly that difficult. It's survivable, um, but strangely enough, even at the extreme difficulty of 23, um, it has tricky notes. So I'm gonna dive into the gacha page here while I'm showing you. Um, a bit of a quick display of what I mean by tricky. There are some notes that require very fast um, change of actions, um, especially with the direction notes. And um, that's pretty annoying and you have to go through it twice. So if you guys don't have that pattern down in your uh, muscle memory, it's gonna be a bit difficult to get a full combo for the extreme difficulty. Then later on, there is the double thumb switch action um, and and it goes into like a different directional swipe as well so oh god I mean it's not exactly very difficult for, for a level 23 difficult the extreme song it's not that unplayable in fact if you struggle through the whole thing with a life recovery active skill you should be able to clear it um, but of course, definitely without the full combo. But for those of us who are trying to full combo the extreme difficulty to clear maybe the mission um, for it, you know, it gets a pretty annoying. Um, so yeah, 
So guys, let me know your thoughts about the extreme difficulty um, notes uh, mapping for this song uh, in the comments down below. Of, of course, you can always tell me like which difficulty you are currently struggling with. You know, maybe in the future I might come up with a tutorial on how you can slowly progress to improve your own personal play, especially for music games. Because I myself personally always struggle with only very hard. Um, then eventually I was able to cross over to the extreme difficulty um, well with months of practice uh, and forcing myself to not be afraid of the extreme difficulty that kind of stuff so anyways guys we are here on the gacha page let's take a look at Basara's brand new seven star episode plate that features Mikimoto's design for my cross crossover life Basara so if you take note of the costume design um, it's actually not very um, well designed because it's just a jacket over Basara's old, you know, t-shirt and jeans costume that we are so well known uh, for him wearing. So <laughs> it's kind of a it's kind of a lazy lazy design. I'm sorry, Mikimoto Sensei, but it feels very lazy. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, you can fight me in the comments for about this, but you know, it, it shows. Um, total score, 4,254. It's not exactly a lot, um, I mean, but it is a 7 star episode play. Most of them, most of them are pretty much around this range. Um, then of course, pay attention that this episode plate focus on charm which is what this event song currently needs and of course voice and soul equally suffers badly pay attention to the other three divas that can use Basara's episode plate in, in case if you want to do it um, I don't know if you want to use this episode plate as a live skill support in the future who knows maybe because you need the high total score for a good high score that kind of stuff and of course the skill charm up and of course if you use this episode play as a uh, macross 7 song center position plate you get that double as um, center skill with the 150 percent boost and score it's the usual stuff that we see in seven star episode plates active skill same thing as usual if this plate has been fully evolved to a seven star form you get to activate it twice uh, giving you that 15 uh, second duration worth of 100 percent boost you know, twice. Okay, Act live skill, it's for a short duration song. Uh, for those of you who are colorblind, I apologize. You have to recognize the Japanese uh, hiragana for short. Um, you know, just to, to understand that this is for a short duration ability. Um, so that's not too bad. At least it has a decent life skill although we, we all know by now that 7 star episode plates life skills are terribly low in percentage so it's it's it does something but not too extreme all right last page and sadly to say um we have yet to see a 7 star episode plate with a special note attachment for a while now so i wonder when that was when that will occur again maybe kaname's upcoming 7 star plate might turn things around it will it could be the only noble episode play that doesn't uh, that includes a special note attachment who knows but i might be wrong we'll see how soon enough um so yeah anyways guys is this a must to pull episode play as usual not really uh unless you are basara stand so there's no reason to pull it and that's why I'm not spending any money this month This month, because Basara and Kaname aren't exactly my top favourite characters. Um, so my wallet is safe uh, for, for the time being. I mean, I've already gone through like last three months of pain in my wallet. So <laughs> it's, it's nice to take a break once in a while. Uh, sigh of relief. Anyway guys, we're gonna do the same usual stuff. We're gonna do the free single pools first. I do have tickets for the Super Dimension gacha that's gonna expire soon. So I'm gonna do that as well. So let's start with the free daily afternoon pool. If you're wondering when I'm recording this video, it's technically a day after this gacha has been reviewed because, well, I want to attain those free event gacha tickets so that I don't have to spend all my sing stones on them gacha pools, you know? Gotta be thrifty or shifty, you know. <laughs> Whichever way that 
Rick and Morty says it. Anyways, uh, yeah. So we didn't. Oh, I didn't even check the variety of the episode play, but still, you know. Okay. So let's do the Super Dimension Gacha first. I'm gonna change things up a bit so we can see how the um, you know the day's luck is. So my next tickets expiration. Oh, that's if I'm pulling ten. Wow, that's like a whole bunch of eleven here. So seven for November. Okay, that would be enough for. Um, Kanami's gacha video, so that's not too bad. So at least, you know, even though we don't pull that many template pulls from the main feature gacha, at least there's still some content of gacha, gacha pulls for you guys to see. Alright, so we did get some loading. Alright, mediocre Valkyrie animation, so today's luck is pretty average. Uh oh, no red boxes and the first blink. Okay, maybe not average, it might be on the lower end side. Hmm. Well, more costume points for the recent Kaname called uh, Halloween costume. Okay. There we go, the only red box, so no evolution. Oh, we can get some Mirai Mirai Love. Alright. That's not too bad. Well, at least for me. I'm a Mirage fan. Oh, it evolved! <laughs> okay. That's not too bad. Gotta look at things as a optimistic perspective. Um positive perspective. You know. Not everything is horrible. Eh, could be worse. Alright, um let's see. So since I'm not spending money, I won't be touching the step up gacha at all. So let's do this. We'll do the free pool from the featured banner. Okay, here we go. Alright, so no Valkyries. We didn't even see any loading, so yeah. It seems like today's luck is still bad. Hmm, surprisingly. So the bad luck streak has been rolling over from October. That's kind of nasty. Okay, so it isn't exactly a very rare plate. So the luck might be there, may not be there, but it's leaning on the not there side. Alright, so we got lots of tickets. I do have my subscription to uh, Utamaku Pass, uh, Special Pass, which is what it is called now. I'm going to save those 10 tickets from the Special Pass for Kanami's Gacha because I don't want to spend too much. Um, I'm going to give both 7 star episode plays a fair chance of maybe trying to pop out. Okay, Ooh. Ooh. what is with this load speed? Okay, here we go. One, two, three. So the pretty. Oh, five Valkyries. So the luck. Oh, two rainbow boxes on. Whoa! Just when I'm complaining that today's luck is horrible. But you know, if. Oh, is it gonna evolve? Oh, it lagged for a moment. Okay, so it's kind of horrible because it gave me a very, very old plate. <laughs> But Max is looking young in this one. <laughs> if you guys know what's upcoming for the uh, the new movie from Macross Delta, you guys would know that joke. Oh! Oh my goodness! Oh, we got one! <laughs> okay, I I wasn't asking for it. I but okay, I'm grateful, very grateful. At least I don't have to add. Another seven star plate to my not gotten list of <laughs> recordings. Okay, so I'm happy. At least it's gonna help with this month's bonus stats. So that's not too bad. So here's the last rainbow box. Oh, some Kumo Kumo left. Gotta say, I love this uh, bikini design. It's very, very adorable. Alright. So another Basara costume in the back. That's fantastic. So do I actually need to pull <laughs> this counter plate pool? I mean, I could save the singing stones for maybe my waifu's gacha in the upcoming month. I mean in the, in the coming weeks. So yeah, do I need to pull? I feel like I shouldn't. Yeah, I feel like I shouldn't at all, but 
you know, just for the lows because I am a content creator. Let's do this. I'm going to waste away the 300 singing stones. But if you guys are in this kind of scenario that I've just gone through and you are free to play players, please save your 300 singing stones. Don't pull it, you know. I'm just doing it because I'm a YouTuber and I'm here to entertain you guys. So, you know, people love to see other people suffer. So let's do this. <laughs> it's, it's a psychological thing. You know, people like to see people suffer, but, you know, that's how the news network gains their views, kind of, you know. There's no bad publicity, yeah, as one would say. Alright, here we go. Alright, there it is, the suffering animation. <laughs> I'm gonna regret this pool one time. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna regret it. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, we are getting a lot of Macross 7 love, which is fantastic. I mean, after all, it's the Macross 7 event. A bit of Nikumo love again. Yep. Yeah. A lot of duplicates. Alright, so, ooh, Mirage for me. I'm good, boys, girls. Um, even though it's a bad pool, personally, it's a win to me. You know, a bit more Mirai love is fantastic. I gotta be grateful for that. Oh, speaking of which, um, for those of you who are following me on the Instagram um, page, um, you probably know that tomorrow, the 2nd of November, is actually the pre-order day for Mirage's brand new Kairos Valkyrie um, that was seen in the Macross Delta movie, the recent one. So for those of you who are Mirage fans like myself, stand by, get ready to pre-order the heck, press the refresh button on all the sites that you're pre-ordering from. Because as most of you guys know, Chogokins are not easy to collect, especially if you're a Macross fan. So tomorrow is Mirage's Kairos turn to be pre-ordered so I wish you guys all the best and of course for those of you who are Utah Macross players I wish you all the best as well um, for your own personal gacha pools I'm sure you guys already probably did your own pools or maybe you guys been waiting to see my luck to see whether you should pull yours I don't know whichever way if you guys already pulled yours I hope you had something nice let me know in the comment section down below as always or uh, if you guys have yet to pull yours I wish you all the best that maybe you'll get something lucky uh, I, I was definitely lucky I wasn't asking for it but it came home for me so I hope it does the same for Kaname then it seems like next month I might suffer in terms of luck and I'm just praying that none of my waifus are appearing. Oh god. <laughs> Anyways guys, thank you guys for joining me on another episode of Utah Micros Gacha videos. Until then, I'll see you guys soon. Bye!